Hey guys and welcome to today's tutorial. In this video I'd like to show my Binance Smart Chain Flashbot. For those who are not familiar with the Flashbot, it's a bot that allows you to do multiple transactions in the same block. If you have a compromised wallet, this bot will be the most powerful bot available on the market. The bot works with any token on the Binance Smart Chain and can work on any wallet as well. It doesn't matter whether it's MetaMask, Trust Wallet, Uniswap, as long as you have the private key or a mnemonic phrase, which are the 12 or 24 words, this bot will work for you. It doesn't matter which bot someone else has installed in your wallet or if they've done anything with smart contracts, this bot will still be able to get your funds out of the compromised wallet. Now with that being said, in this video I'd like to show how to do one of these rescues. So as you can see, we've got one USDT in this wallet right here. This is the compromised wallet. So we're now on the Binance Smart Chain Scan website. And as you can see, there's no BNB balance in the wallet at all. And the wallet is holding one USDT. So, step by step, what you need to do in order to have this bot rescue these funds is first of all, you need to export the private key of your victim signer. This is the compromised wallet, the wallet that has been hacked or compromised by a hacker, a scammer, or anyone else. Once you've exported the private key, you'll go over to Visual Studio Code and paste in the victim key. You'll then go over to the donor signer. This is the wallet that has BNB in it that will pay to rescue the funds out of the victim signer. So you're going to export the private key once again. You're going to enter your password and copy the private key. You'll then go over to Visual Studio Code again and paste it in in the donor key. And now the final step is also really simple. You're just going to go over to the compromised wallet. You're going to go over to Binance Smart Chain Scan. You're going to go over to the token you want to rescue. You'll then be sent over to the token page where you're going to go over to other information and you're going to copy the token contract address. Now in Visual Studio Code, you're going to paste in the token address. And once you've done that, you're now good to go. You can also see the cons provider line, which is the JSON RPC provider, which the bot will be talking to in order to process the flashbot transactions. And now all you're going to do is to simply go over to run and debug and you can then see that now the bot has done the transaction. And as you can see, the funds are now in the donor signer and out of the victim signer. If you go over to the Binance Smart Chain Scan website and you scroll down, you can also see that in the same block, which ends on 894, BNB comes into the wallet, in this case just enough to cover the gas fees, and then in the same block, the BUSDT stablecoin or the USDT stablecoin gets transferred to the donor signer. So if you go over to token transfers BAP20, you can also see that the address the token has been sent to, which is this one right here, is the same address that is this address. It starts with A1F8 and ends on 360C. 360C. Now the bot also allows for custom gas prices. You can use the custom gas price feature in order to outbid other people that might have access to the same bot in your wallet. Now if you're not experienced with this and you'd like me to help out and do the rescue for you, I can do that for a 20% fee. However, I assume that most people would like to buy the bot themselves, which is also possible. Now I'd need to say that this bot is not cheap. It's the most powerful bot out there and it's a price of 2 BNB. I'd also like to share some screenshots on the screen right now. These are reviews of people that have bought this bot from me and that are satisfied with the ease of use and how the bot works. If you'd like to buy this bot, please reach out on Telegram, at Lucasen, and please be aware that there's a lot of people pretending to be me, so make sure to look at the name on your screen, at Lucasen, and only contact me on that exact handle. I will also leave a link to my Telegram group in the link down below, where you can reach out to me as well. Now with that being said, I hope you liked watching this tutorial, and I hope to talk to you on Telegram soon. Have a nice day, and thanks for watching.